Hey, YouTubers! What's going on, guys? Part 2 of my DVD update. Wanted to start it off here with this Haunted Histories collection. I got this big-ass fucking box set on eBay. Paid a little bit more than what I wanted to, but it was, it was fucking brand new. I think I got a... Won the bid for like 30 bucks or something like that, 29 But anyway, yeah. Some fucker jumped me at the last minute and brought it way the hell up there. So yeah, man. We got volume 1, 2, all the way to volume 8 of this shit. Now, uh, I love my hauntings. And this was just phenomenal. And it's fucking huge. You got that. I mean, it's that fucking thick, guys. It's big. And then every single one of them, check this out. Yeah, they all have different, uh, like, looking, well, those two are the same. Fuckers, things. There we go. But yeah, it's Dracula, Witches, Voodoo, Exorcism, uh, Haunting, Zombies, and Voodoo, History, Spookiest, Phenomena, Phenomenon, America's Most Haunted Places. But yeah, this was awesome. Thought I'd start off with that. Uh, picked the Night of the Creeps, the director's cut. Fucking classic, classic film. Love it. The Loved Ones picked us up at the rental store. Of course, it's not the unrated version. But, you know, fuck, I got it for like two bucks. So it can't beat that shit. Love that film. Uh... April Fool's Day, the unrated piece of shit remake. Fucking piece of shit. And then we got here. I wanted both of these. Never seen them before. Uh, that's also when I got that one. But I watched this one first. April Fool's Day on here. Fucking amazing. Love it. My Bloody Valentine. Fucking rocks. Kicks ass. Uh, I wanted both of them. I found this for brand new. Flipper disc. I think I got it for uh, three bucks, but the fucking remake is horrible. Can't stand that one. Paranormal Activity 4, the unrated edition. Absolutely terrifying. It wasn't bad, but I like the paranormal, uh, <clears throat> paranormal shit. I like the paranormal. Picked up the hazing. This was fucking awesome. Complete cheese fest, you know. Uh, kind of a... You can tell that there was a lot of the Evil Dead kind of thing going on with it. Uh, pretty good, pretty good. And I think the only reason I got it is because of... What the fuck? Tiffany Sheppis. Tiffany Sheppis is in it. Uh, got here Ginger Snaps Unleashed 2. Have yet to get the first one. First one's getting a little tedious for me to get a good copy. Most of them were shitty and I'm like no. But yeah, I got Ginger Snaps too. I love Ginger Snaps. That chick in there is Catherine, whatever the fuck. Hot. Hotness. Now here she's got a movie. Uh was it in the UK or some shit where she's like a surgeon. I don't know. I think I heard Willie Mark One talking about it. Uh, I heard he's got it. I want it. Anyway, Species 2, picked this up for two bucks at the pawn shop. Mr. Snickers 21, loves fucking species. I love them too, man. It's good shit. Got some Mask Maker, Meet Your Maker. This was, uh, the first time I seen this was on Netflix, I do believe. Fucking awesome, guys. This is a good slasher. I enjoyed the shit out of it. And there is some nice tits in this movie. Just saying, you know, just saying. I'm not gay. We got high tension. I used to own this a long time ago. Think I sold it. Don't remember. But I had to get it again. I got this at the pawn shop also. Really great condition. A <laughs> great movie. The ending will fucking trip your mind. You got a double feature here of Bordello of Blood and Demon Knight. Uh I got it mostly for Demon Knight. I love that film. Billy Zane. I mean this has gotta be his greatest film ever. Uh, Bordello of Blood, do not much care for. Not a big Dillis, Dillis, Bill, fucker. Dennis Miller fan. Let's throw that over there on that pile. Got here, Ghost Ship. 
piece of shit case. But uh, good ghost ghost story. Really enjoy it. And the Beastmaster. Found this at the pawn shop for two bucks. Had to pick this shit up. Let's open it. See what it's like. Yeah, there we go. It's still got the fucking insert. The disc. And it's just, it's awesome. So, yeah, I could not pass this up. Uh, it is released by Anchor. Let me get the light. There we go. Anchor Bay. Fucking Beastmaster, man. That's some good shit. Picked up Heavyweights. Childhood classic. Fucking Walt Disney. Pretty good. Found it in the $5 bin at Walmart. Haven't seen it since. So I'm glad I picked this up. Haven't watched it yet. I mostly got it just to have it in the collection. My boys will love it when they get to watch it. They haven't really watched it yet either. So there's that stack, guys. In a messy ass bed. That's right. Been getting jiggy with it. The fuck's getting jiggy with it? You know, scratch that, reverse that. No un no editing this shit, guys. Not doing it. But anyway, take care. Comment below. Tell me how fucking stupid I am. I don't give a shit. Take care, guys. Later.